Welcome back, viewers. Can you believe it's been seven weeks? We've been doing virtual school for seven weeks. I hope everyone in your family has been safe, okay? So let's get started. Today, boys and girls, I'm gonna be teaching you how to use possessive BAM pronouns. My objective okay. is, by the time I get done with this video, you will be able to identify and use correctly in speaking and writing possessive pronouns. So, let's get started. All right, what is a possessive pronoun? Hmm, a possessive, look right here. A possessive pronoun is a pronoun that shows ownership, okay? Um, remember this, a possessive pronoun takes the place of a possessive noun. Look right there, now. Don't forget that. Uh, there are two types of possessive pronouns. Here we go. Look on this side right here. Bam, this side right here. You have the singular, and on this side you have plural, okay? What are some examples of singular possessive pronouns? Here we go. You have my, your, his, hers, and its. On the plural side, boom, right there. You have our, your, and their. These are the, these are the two types of possessive pronouns. Excuse me. Take a look at this sample sentence that I have right here below. Look at it. Elena and Elena's sister throw sticks. Hmm. So, how did that sound to you? A little too wordy, huh? I agree. All right? No one talks like that. Elena and Elena's sister were throwing sticks. Okay? Now, to determine whether to use a possessive pronoun, you have to ask yourself two questions. Okay? Question number one. Let's take a look at the sample sentence right here. Look at it. It says, Elena and Elena's sister were throwing sticks. Okay? Now, question number one. Are there possessive nouns in the sentence? That means, is there any sentence that shows ownership? And that means, are there any sentences that have an apostrophe S? That's, the, that's how we know it shows ownership. So let's take a look. Elena and, Ale oh, there it is. Elena's. See that positive S right there? See it? That's the noun that shows ownership. All right, so we're going to need a possessive noun to replace it that also shows ownership. So that is why we use possessive pronouns. Okay? Number two. Do... Any of those nouns need to, be, need to be replaced to avoid repetition, or better known as double talk. Let's take a look at the sample set. Here we go. Look at it. Bam. There it is. Elena and Elena's sister were throwing sticks. Okay? So, we don't want to say Elena and Elena. That would be what, guys? Double talk. And we don't want to hear no double talk. And we definitely don't want to write with double talk. You got it? Good. Because I know you do. All right. Your assignment. Bam. This is what I need you to do. Bam. Let's do this worksheet that I have right here for you. Okay? I need you to do this worksheet right here. So that's my lesson on possessive pronouns. Okay? All right. I know you like a book, and I hope everything's going well with you and yours. All right? Until next time, work on those possessive pronouns, and I'll see you soon. And I'm out of here. Peace.